Warning, this is a pest control video and it will show pests being controlled with air rifles. If this is likely to offend you, then please stop watching now. For the rest of you who like these type of videos, let's get on with the action. Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Pontypool Pest Control. In today's video, me and the new deputy are going to help out with a big rat problem. Soon as we turned up, we didn't have to look far to find them. They were running everywhere. We needed to come up with a plan to stop them long enough to be able to shoot them. Before we get into the action and show you the plan that we come up with, let's go back and take a look how this night actually started. The sheriff was at home chilling on the PlayStation 5, but as you can see, I'm still getting in our all important gun time and practicing my trigger control. When the sheriff's in town, you online players are going down. The deputy's outside and that's just in time as well. The deputy has just picked me up in his camper van. He took me to the garage to get me some crisps and pop. Tonight I feel like the sheriff. This is what it's all about. I hope there's a few page free models in the back, ready to feed me some grapes and fan me down. I could also make very good use of them Viagra jerry pellets. Hee ha, cowboy! Now we're at the farm, let's take a quick look at their models. I'm only joking, don't get too excited, I meant let's take a look at the kit I'm going to be using tonight. My rifle choice this evening is the FX Impact Mark III in 177 calibre and the scope is the Pad 008 LRF. LRF stands for Laser Rangefinder. I will also be taking my gun strap, even though this gun is small and compact, after walking around for a while it starts to ache my arms. I like to take two added IRs, one for long range rabbit shooting and the others for short range rat shooting, just in case I fancy switching up on permissions. My pellet choice this evening is the Air Arms Field Diablo and the JSB Exacts, both of them weigh 8.44 grains. This gun loves them and shoots them both very accurate. To save me time reloading, I will be using the Eagle Vision magazine, it holds 38 shots and comes in handy when shooting on a very busy permission. And finally, the Ick Micro LH25 Thermal. Now this really is a game changer and it definitely helps you add more to your bag and you'll find more shots that with a night vision alone you would pass over and over again. And I always take lots of spare batteries just in case I'm going to be out for a few hours. Before we start shooting, let's take a quick look around so you at home can get a feel of this permission. This is one of the cow sheds with lots of rat activity. As you can see there's loads of holes and tunnels running all under the bottom of the wall, giving the rats access to any room they feel like using. And believe me they was using all of the rooms. I even had one jump out at me. It may have got a bit excited and wanted my autograph, but I didn't hang around to find out. I ran outside and started shaking my clothes. The plan we came up with was the same as always. Bait it all up with some nice peanut butter and as soon as they stop the feed, we'll take them out one by one. Out comes the first rat of the evening, and he just can't believe his luck. He's only gone and pulled. But unlucky for him, there's only got to be one person tonight led on their back with their legs wide open.
In all my years out shooting, this is the first time I've ever seen anything like this. This rat has got itself stuck between the wall. So the only thing I could do was put him out of his misery. Later on in the evening, when we went down with the litter pickers, it took us a few minutes to get him out. This next shot is a perfect example of the Viagra jelly pellets in action. For those of you that don't believe that they work, just watch this. So that's it, lights out. Keep watching, keep watching. Here it comes. It stiffened him right up. And finally, there's a few shots from the deputy. Let's take a look at him in action. Sadly it's our time again, we've come to the end of the video. Did you notice that only one shot was taken in the shed? The rats were fed too well and even the smell of peanut butter didn't faze them. So we had to make do with what was around the yard and there was plenty. There will be a few more videos to come from you yet. If you're new to the channel please consider subscribing, not to miss out on any of my upcoming videos. I look forward to chatting to you all in the comments. Thank you very much for watching, keep safe, until next time. All the best, Pontypool Pest Control, aka the Sheriff, your sub 12 foot pound king.